So I'm doing another video here on the core temperature of a CPU. And the previous video I did was on the AMD FX 8220, which is a eight core processor. And that processor uh, idles at around 20 degrees Celsius, uh, even lower, like maybe 18 degrees Celsius, um, you know, doing normal stuff like web surfing. And it goes up as high as 60 degrees Celsius on the torture test. And I really want to compare it to this Core i5 Intel that I have. Because I, I was a little bit surprised at how much heat this generates. So I'm going to demonstrate it right now with basically the same configuration. So here I have a Prime 95, uh, which uh, te does the test by doing prime prime number calculations. So I'm gonna uh, actually let me show you the core temperature here. Uh, same setup, uh, CPU ID and core temp, and you could see here right even when it's idling, it's already at 49 degrees Celsius, which is uh, pretty hot. And this is a Core i5 2450M, which is the mobile processor. And uh, you, you could see it has two cores, but it runs four threads. So uh, it's two cores and four threads, which is typical of a i5, core i5 here. Um, so let me do that. I'm going to crank it up with the Prime 95. Um, so, and, and as you can see with this hardware info, I, I have an 8 gig. Uh, again, it's a Core i5-2450 mobile. Um, but let me just kick off the torture test here, as I did in the previous video. And I suppose it is a big difference because the other, even though that is an 8-core and AMD processor in my previous video, it is a desktop with a full-size fan and all, so... Um, so here you can see I'm kicking off the torture test and right away it just kicks up to 73 degrees Celsius and um, I don't know if you can quite hear that sound but the fan is cranking up also already and if I look at this it's maxing out at 100 so it's already at 80 degrees Celsius. And uh, in, in, in my AMD, the top temperature is 60 degrees Celsius or 61 degrees Celsius. And even at that temperature, it's like at the upper bound of what is safe for the AMD. Whereas for this Core i5, it's already cranking up to 84 degrees Celsius. And I actually haven't researched what is really safe range for this Core i5-2450. But um, I just wanted to do a comparison of just the temperatures in general and uh, how, you know, I guess it is not surprising that some people in the AMD community crank up their 8 cores or their FX processors to 70 degrees or even 80 degrees. So, um, but okay, uh, that's really all I wanted to demonstrate, uh, basically a comparison between the two temperatures. And you can find my other video uh, in my video collection where I am demoing the core temperature of the AMD FX 8220, which is an 8-core desktop processor. Okay, thank you.